Hey, what's up? Sean Zetterland here, and I'm here today to talk about this low boy custom beater. Um, this is a kind of a boutique beater company that's based in Denver, Colorado, and I'm sure you've heard of this. Um, if you're watching this video, you've probably heard of these. Um, there's a lot of social media hype on these, so uh, I decided to check it out because um, I don't know. I saw a lot of drummers who got really good uh, tones out of their bass drum uh, using these beaters. And uh, yeah, it's, it, it lives up to the hype, I'd definitely say so. Um, it's a two-sided beater, actually, even if you think it might only be a one-sided, you know, if you're just looking at this, you think you can only use this side, but you could actually use this side, too. Um, this side, you get this really nice, punchy tone. Um, it's, it's kind of uh, reminds me of the DW uh, two-way beater a little bit, but just a, a little bit more low end. And it's really good for rock, uh, pop, uh, just pretty much you know, hip-hop, anything you can really think of. This side, I uh, I found it really good for um, lower volume situations, like if you're uh, feathering the bass drum. And if you don't know what that means, then you should probably go on Drumio. And um, it also gives you a pretty uh, similar sound to the other side um, if you lay into it. But uh, it doesn't come with that really low-end punch that I think these things are really known for. So I like sticking with uh, this side instead. Um, I'm going to show you a video here of playing on both sides, just a demonstration so you kind of get an idea of uh, what it sounds like. And just so you know what uh, gear I'm using, I'm using a Pearl Birch Master Shell, and um, I'm recording that through a Shure Beta 52, all right? So check it out. 